In this video, I am going to show you how to create a table of contents in Google Sheets. So sometimes when you have a large spreadsheet, making a table of contents can make it easier to navigate through your data. So you can create a table of contents in two different ways. You can create one so that when you click on a link, it will pull up a certain sheet within your workbook. Or you can create one that when you click on a link, it will pull up a different range of data. So I'm going to show both methods for creating a table of contents. So the first one I'm going to show is creating a table of contents that leads to different sheets. So what you have to do is click on the cell where you want to insert your first table of contents link and then right click and select this insert link option or alternatively you can press Control and k on your keyboard to insert link so i'm going to select this insert link and then what you want to do is select this at the bottom sheets and named ranges and i'm going to select my first sheet that i want to link to and it will be named already with the name of the sheet so i have these different sheets in my workbook with sales data for these different items and they are named the item. So then you just repeat the process with every other link that you want to place for your table of contents. So I'm going to do one for each item. And then I am done. And now when I click on it, it brings me to that sheet or that tab in my workbook. So that is one way of doing a table of contents. The next way I'm going to show is making a table of contents for different ranges of data. So instead of opening up the sheet when I click on the link, it's going to navigate down to the range. So to do this, the process is very similar to the first method. The first thing that you do is you click on the cell where you want to place the first link and then insert link. And then you select sheets and named ranges at the bottom and then at the bottom, there's going to be this option, select a range of cells to link. Now from here, you can either manually type in your range or you can just highlight the range of data that you want in. So I've highlighted this and I'm going to select OK. So that's my first range. And now I'm going to repeat the process for all of the other ranges of data that I want in here. And then I will put my last range in here. So now this, if I click on one, it's going to navigate me down to that section of data, that range. Now, as you will notice, the names of these links is just ranges. If you want to make them a little bit more descriptive, you can rename them by hovering over it and then you have this option here edit link so what you want to do is change the text of the link so I will just change this to t-shirt and then I'll change this one to socks and then we have jeans and hat And so now when I click on one of these, it brings me down to that range of data. So those are two different ways that you can create a table of contents in Google Sheets. If you have any questions, just let me know. Thank you for watching the video. If you haven't already, make sure to hit the subscribe button. If you have any questions or content suggestions, just let me know in the comments and I'll try my best to answer everyone.